Building the RV-12 IS involves a lot of pop rivets, which is totally different from what I'm used to with the, uh, the RV-9A that I built. So there's a little tool that you have to use when you get in tight corners, and it's a wedge. The wedges you use for doing these pop rivets in tight corners, are they're made from the trailing edge long strip of, of aluminum that uh, goes in like the, the flaps and the uh, horizontal stabilizer, the uh, elevators. So you have to cut this thing into small pieces and then put a cut, drill a hole in the middle for the uh, mandrel to go through. And uh, this uh, goes into the hole, especially when you're doing close in type, you know, close in type pop rivets. So when putting an LP4-3 pop rivet in, in tight quarters, it's a little, it's almost, well it is, it's impossible to do without the wedge. It's just not gonna work. So we use the wedge. It allows you to bend things a little bit. Not necessarily bend, but just to get it in there. So the wedge is positioned to where you can get in there and have actually pull down on the uh, mandrel to make the uh, proper. So you push down. and then make the pop rivet. Your first impression is, oh my God, I screwed up. But then, there it is. Not bad. All done. Looks half decent.